The Great Lakes Timber Show brings the American logging history to life. Spectators get a glimpse of what it was like to be a logger when man faced towering trees with only an axe or a buck saw. The Great Lakes Timber Show features logging skills from the late 1800s that are still tested today in national competitions. The kids really like the chainsaw carving demonstration. While joking that he is making a chainsaw stand, a solid log is carefully carved into several small chairs that are handed out to youngsters now, in the we crowd. Find out what he made. Oh, what did I make? I what made make? chairs. Six little chairs. Six little chairs on a one block of wood. How about that? <laughs> there you go. All right. To get the audience involved in the axe throwing contest, they are split into two cheering sections to cheer on their favorite lumberjack as they aim for the target on the stage. The daredevil antics thrill the young, and young at heart. Did you know that a two-man cross-cut saw can beat a chainsaw through a log? The audience is amazed at the feat. That is until a modified chainsaw appears. How about a nice hand for Dale and Matt? Your shoulder or your face? Never ever start one like that. The loggers clown around a lot with the equipment in a way, well, don't try this at home. You don't ever treat your equipment that way. Well, of course not. What do you mean, of course not? That ain't mine. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't yours. No. Who's in it? That's yours. <laughs> One of the most exciting logging sport events features the razor-sharp axes used in the chopping demonstration. Powerful strokes with a big axe break a chopping block within seconds. The logger's ability will amaze the crowd. Log rolling or burling has long been a fun event and is the event that everyone waits for. Are you going to be okay? I don't think so. <laughs> it showcases the skills of the old river drives when the logs were taken to the sawmills. A king of the mountain type game is played out on a tank of water where anything goes. In some cases, young lumberjacks and Joes from the crowd are invited to show off their log rolling skills. They often find the sport to be more difficult than it looks. Wonderful, very entertaining, and the, the log roll contest is amazing. How they could stay up there is just amazing to me. Go, so, stay on top, stay on top. Whoa! How about a nice hand for all of our volunteers? Woo! All right. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is going to be exciting. The Great Lakes Timber Show's three performers provide three 30 minute shows during weekdays and four 30-minute shows on weekends. The crew provides all of the timber and equipment necessary to put on the show, including a log rolling tank, sound system, and liability insurance. Venues are asked to provide a 24 by 24 foot level area, 
110 voltage electrical outlets and a means to fill the log rolling tank with 3,700 to 7,000 gallons of water. The Great Lakes Timber Show features national and world champions in log rolling, axe throwing, and modified chainsaw events. They are the best competitors in the logging sport competitions. Bruce Belangi has performed in logging sport shows since the 1970s. From a small town in Michigan's Upper Peninsula, Bruce comes from a region where logging was and still is a way of life. Bruce believes humor and laughter is an important part of entertainment in a family program. <laughs> the comedy stunts are funny, a little ridiculous, and educational by emphasizing safety with the logging equipment. The Great Lakes Timber Show always draws a crowd. 